to the GIS tutorial again. I am done my Mozunda. From great, staying with you. Today we will learn how to digitize a map automatically. So let's start. At first, uh, you have to add the JPEG image which you want to digitize. Here, I digit I want to digitize this image. Uh, double click on the image, then you see three bands. If the image is colored, uh, in this case, you have to choose just one band from uh, these three bands because. If you select uh, the color JPEG image, then you don't get the classified option. For getting classified option, you uh, have to uh, choose a black and white image. For making the image black and white, I just choose band 1. Then you get a black and white image. Then right click on image then go to data and export data here uh, we see a dialog box uh, here we see the number of data uh, 256 here uh, the required thing not zero blank uh, then um, give a name of the image and change the file format to imagine image then save the image yes and uh, now uh, here the imagine image and it is not necessary in, in this case so of the layer now double click on the imagine image go to symbology then classify and make the classes just to black and white then press ok we digitize the whole map uh, by taking polyline uh, shape file then we convert it to polygon so go to art catalog and choose your specific folder where you want to create some shape file here I want to create new shape file so right click on the folder and new shape file and the shape file is plot line then feature type will be polyline and uh, it should be mentioned that uh, before digitizing I georeference the image and uh, the projection system is here yeah, the projection system is btm so put the projection system and press ok then uh, go to editor menu and click start editing i want to edit plot line so click ok for automatic digitizing we use ArcScan toolbar uh, uh, but before using ArcScan toolbar go to customize and press extension then I select all the extension here uh, you have to check the ArcScan toolbar uh, as I previously check it so I close the window then right click on the menu bar then check art scan here we use the art scan toolbar then on the art scan toolbar uh, there is option show preview it's automatically vectorized the map after clicking show preview you see that the all plot are automatically digitized including plot number but we don't need the plot number to be digitized 
so we, we have to delete this plot number for delete this plot number for delete or erase this plot number automatically uh, go to raster cleanup tool and click start cleanup then uh, cell selection and select connected cell here uh, we see a di dialog box then you have to enter the total area of raster pixel uh, say I put 250 then you see that the mm, number which we want to delete all are selected but here it is not selected so increase the value then see this one is also selected then go to raster cleanup and click erase selected cell then we able to erase all the plot number but here we see that these plot number are not uh, erased because the plot numbers are joined to uh, adjacent polygon uh, so uh, for erasing it go to raster cleanup and raster choose the raster painting toolbar and this toolbar is used to uh, clean this plot number go to erase and just make it separate from the polygon then click magic erase and just select the area then all are automatically erases um, uh, before I show you how to automatically erase the plot number you can use the magic erase for manual erasing of the plot number in this way you have to erase all the plot number that we are not need You have to also join the line which are not connected. Here I want to mention that magic erase only erase the connected cells and fill them with the background color.
now all the undesired uh, plot number are deleted then you um, click vectorization tab and click generate feature then just press ok then the map is uh, digitized then uncheck imagine image then you see the uh, digitized map here i delete undesired line now i convert it to polygon shape file for converting uh, this to polygon uh, go to arc toolbox then data management tool then features and feature to polygon click feature to polygon uh, choose the input feature which we want to this is plot line drag it here or you can choose it by clicking the drop down arrow or from here then uh, choose the output features destination I choose it to here the name is poly or poly then save it here we see a option xy tolerance when two lines are not connected um, and there uh, is a gap between uh, two lines um, say for one meter gap if we put the tolerance on meter then uh, the gap is not considered at the time of consider um, at the time of converting polygon so i put the xy tolerance on meter and press ok here we see that all polyline shape are converted to polygon but some are missing uh, before uh, make it polygon save it save edit and then again uh, start editing here we edit plot poly and press ok then go to create feature and select plot poly now you have to man manually digitize the four polygons which are not uh, digitized automatically in the previous tutorial you gained the knowledge about how to manual manually digitize a map so here for digitize the adjacent polygon i take autocomplete polygon and In this way, you can automatically digitize any map, uh, but uh, here we see that we have to perform uh, some manual process uh, because of the 
quality of uh, because of the low quality of image the pre requirement of automatic digitizing is um, you have to scan the image very clearly but my image is not scanned very clearly so we uh, perform some manual process of digitizing if you scan your image very clearly you can digitize uh, your map at once by the help of automatic or semi automatic digitization process so thanks for watching be well